coins. We found coins, but we really need our rune keys. Okay, no fake walls here. Not that I'm seeing at least. My light is gone. Yeah, the light is gone. I mean, do you think I need the light for finding all the other stuff? I found that first key without needing it. Oh, here's another rune. Beauty symbol added to inventory. You were right. I don't know if I would have thought to do that. Might be in the basement. You guys see it? No, I don't see it, right? Not down here? All right, we lost it. Beauty symbol. Beauty. Now that's something I can relate to. I'm so beautiful. All right, we need one more. This is it here, right? All right, innocence. Who needs a stairmaster when you have a castle tower? That's true. So, ready to collect our reward, dear dreamer? Let's go stay here. I wonder if this uh, closes off. Is there anything left in the dungeon? I wonder if this ends it. Anybody know? I know there was another rune keyhole down below. Rare. If you take the light down to there, you might be able to open it to find the rune. I already opened the rune, let's see. Is anyone even playing this? I don't know. Perhaps our friend from Zen Studios knows. It was in a jail cell? I don't think we can get there that that fast. Cause this light expires very quickly. Cracker Viso says, uh, no worries at all. If I solve this puzzle right now, right? It, it's telling me, Yoska, so ready to collect a reward, dear dreamer? Um, it, does that close off this dungeon to me so I can't go and explore the rest of it? Do you know? Yeah. Because that war that warning that I get right here makes, me, makes it feel like it's going to get me out of this dungeon and I can't come back. Save it and then find out? I could do that. It will close it off for now, but if you have a save file, you can come back. Uh, okay. All right, so let's just let's just go one more throughout the one more look throughout the dungeon, see if there's anything that we missed. All right, thanks for the info. That's true, Marauder. No, I know. I realize not many people are probably this at this stage of the first dungeon here. All right, there is a save game here, which we haven't saved in a while. We'll save it on slot three. Oh, I didn't get all the secrets at all. I got two out of eight. All 
Like, we never got across this pool. That's one of the things. So what I recommend, if anybody's going to be playing this, I recommend as you go through the dungeon, right? If there's ever a way... You know what I'm going to do? I'm actually going to follow my own advice. I hope it saves it. Um, where was I just? Up here? Right here. I'm going to mark this. Place marker. Okay, I can't I can't actually put a note on there, it doesn't look like, but at least I'll have a marker there. That's one thing we should come back and check. Okay. Statue was interactable near the pool? Was it? I can't reach it. This one? Oh, place item. Copper crown? Seems the statue of the king has lost its head. We should make them all like that. So they match. I don't have the item for that. All right, all right. Good eye, Alaska. I would not have noticed that. We can put his head on there. Okay. Looks like there's a secret door here. Wait, how do we get in here? Look, I can see on the map. Look at this. You can kind of see there's a room there. Hey! Let me in there. Is that the pool you need to throw the crown in? It's supposed to be a well in the forest that you put that crown in. Right? It's a well in the forest. Could be more hidden stuff in here too. Like this. Chest key. That was another. Oh, look, there's another pressure plate that we never stepped on before. That opened up this over here? It did. Look at this. Uh oh. Bloop, bloop. Alright, we found a secret. Ah, I can't breathe. Oh no! Oh no! We need oxygen real bad. Ah! Ah! No! Gotta get out! No! No! Whoa! <laughs> That was close. That was really close. Okay. Um, I Marie, can you jump into that pool? No, it doesn't let you jump into that pool. You can't go through. Drop in the poo? No, not drop in the poo. Cracker Viso says, I have to go. Thank you for playing Operencia. The whole team is so happy you're enjoying it. Congratulations on the launch of the game, Cracker. Thanks for checking in and say hi to the whole team for me. We'll probably be streaming this uh, more than just today, too. So if you guys want to hop back in another day and say hi, we would love that. We would love that. There's a treasure right here. All right. Dragon Tears, I'm not just doing this because it causes you agita. All right? This is not one of those moments. This is legit like where I have to go. When was my last stretch break? I haven't taken any breaks today because I'm smart. All right. Leather shoulder pad. Okay. Okay. 
All right, there we go. We found a secret. <laughs> Leather shoulder pad? Was not expecting that. I got shoulder mic pads. Where do shoulder pads go? Oh, okay. They replace your tunic, huh? This shoulder pad makes wearers look bigger and stronger while offering some decent protection as well. So we lose a little bit of block, but everything up goes. Everything else goes way up. And this this is like more of a mixed bag. Actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna take this because the leather jerkin gives dexterity, agility, which this guy needs. So let's do that. Let's do that. They go into the 70s and 80s? Is that what they do? Alright, so we found another foot thingy. Um, I wonder if they just do this to the map for funsies and it doesn't actually indicate anything. You know what I mean? Because look, you can kind of see there's another one over here. You can get in there somehow, maybe. What the hell is going on here? Can I rotate this one? Nah, I don't even think it's worth it. Can't even really get in there. Alright, so... We can go up over this way. Okay. Underdark says, I've really enjoyed today's stream, but I have to go and do some missions with my guild. I have fun and see you tomorrow. All right, Underdark. I'm going to be streaming, uh, hopefully, potentially, uh, for another five hours or so. So if you have time to come back. Otherwise, I'll see you tomorrow. Do we have 15 minutes on the clock? Is that what we got? I can't see. Oh, yeah. 15 minutes. 14 minutes and 40 seconds on the clock, gang. That's when the stream ends. Oh, you're right. There is another one of these. The Innocence one. All right, Alaska, you were totally right. All right, this is where it is. How do we get back down here with the light beam in time? We got to get down here real quick. How do we do that? No, it's gonna be over this way. All right, so we're gonna come this way all the way down. Yeah, Marauder just put a link in chat, guys, explaining how to add time to the stream. The stream would technically end in 14 minutes with a five minute wrap up time. Unless we add time to the stream. Alright, let's go. Am I going to be able to figure, figure out my way all the way back to that spot in time? Actually, I think I went up the wrong way. this one we want to do, right? Do I need to get down there with the light or do I need to get down there with the rune? I need I need the rune for it, but I can't find that rune without the light. Oh, this is where it is. It's right here. Okay. So how do I get back to the light room? The light room. Is there a different way to get there? Helvetica Bold with the bits! All right. Thank you so much. 
Can you change levels of the map? Yeah, you can, but I don't know. I don't know where it was. Thank you so much, Havetica. That adds another 10 minutes to the stream. Is the room going to be on that level or other levels? Probably on that level. Basement, basement, Lake Anna. Where is that throne room? The game, uh, we need, we need to have the ability to, uh, put notes on the map. You know what I mean? Be able to write notes. That'd be super helpful. Five more secrets not found, I know. This is just the first dungeon. I'm not gonna, uh stay in this first dungeon until I find every single secret. I'm not gonna do that, but... At least we know where that light seal is. I'd like to get into that. not here, is it? No, this is the other one. Sure, there could be another light well that's closer. That's an interesting uh, thought. I had not considered. Okay, so this whole place... This whole section is done. This goes back to the beginning. Yeah, I don't think it's over here. Golomancy! Let's keep going a bit longer. Thanks, Golomancy! I appreciate it, man. Uh-oh. Golomancy's here now to make fun of my puzzle-solving skills. How's it going, buddy? This game's super fun so far, man. I don't know if you've been watching much. Okay, and this we don't need to go in, right? So we got the treasure in here already? Yeah, we got this. Alright, that's where the light is. That's where the light, uh, the light well is. And the light key that we need. Here we go. None of that works. Regular said if I had $25, spend, I'd buy the 2,500 bits and give them all. Oh, no worries, Regulator. I understand not everybody can do that. I'm just happy you're here. But it's good that you mentioned that. There is a bit deal going on right now, gang. Only until the end of this month, you could buy 2,500 bits with $25. Usually Twitch has a... Um, a fee that goes on top of it when you buy bits. And uh, one time per account, you can buy 2,500 bits without any fee. So the $25 that you spend gets passed directly along to your favorite streamers. There you go. Rabbit, thank you so much. Hey, look, you still got the, you still got the super cute vibrating guy. <laughs> You got it there. There you go. Okay, so here's the throne room. You guys are gonna have to help me get back this way. So it's this way up here. There's still bad things in this tower. 24 months is utterly amazing! Hail the conquering hero! Should I just a little bit longer? Please, please, I will. please, say you will. I will! 
Nightmare Peach, that's gonna add time. Resubs count too. Resubs add time to the stream. Thank you so much. Nightmare Peach, did you change your Twitch name by chance? Because I don't recognize that name. If you changed your name, send me a message on Discord with your old Twitch name and your new Twitch name. The exact names. So I can look up your clams in uh, hours. All right, here's the light well. Here we go. Don't worry about it. Okay, it's up to you. Uh. Is it this way? Gang, I'm lost. See, I knew I needed your help. Uh. Is it this way? Oh, it goes away so quick. I was close. too hard. You can just call me the 49th state in December in the year 9th. That's Alaska winter. You changed your name? Alaska. What? There's got to be another symbol on a wall somewhere. We've gotten this one, right? Yeah. We got this one. Yeah. Okay. Is there one here? That we haven't seen? All the way down? Okay, ran out. Okay. Um, the closer you get to a hidden room, the brighter it gets. But as you explore the environment, the effect expires and the vial needs to be refilled. Okay, so distance to hidden objects. So this kind of gives you an indication of how close or how far you are, right? Am I getting closer? Doesn't seem to be. How about this way? Okay, this gets closer, closer, closer. Is this closer? Closer. Nope. Damn it! <laughs> okay, so somewhere over here. At least that helps you so you don't just going around blindly. Is this game purely about puzzles? No, Arland. There's fighting and combat and character progression. But we just happen to be in a part where we're trying to solve a puzzle. Alright. We're looking at the thing in the top right hand corner here. No, it seems to get brighter nice and bright over here no not here no it's it's dissipating here god it, it's somewhere in here is it somewhere in this room you guys when we get to the throne room you guys can help with this by the way Totally, we can figure this out together. Rabbit says, I think I see a thing near the rug. 
on the wall. All right. On the rug. No, oh, it's it's got to be on the other side. Oh, can that? It's got to be like over here, maybe. Can that thing please last like I don't know, fifteen more seconds? Okay. That'd be a great talent point to spend, so that that goes away much slower. Here it is, right there. Got it. Secret found. Nice. Now, <laughs> where is... <laughs> Alright, is it this over here? It's over there, yeah? Okay. So, let's go. We got it, by the way. Yes. Alright, let's get over there. See if this is worth it. Tall Father says this is basically an updated version of the old Eye of the Beholder games. Like it, I, I actually mentioned that earlier. I said it does remind me of Eye of the Beholder. Eye of the Beholder, Legend of Grimrock, kind of a little bit like Bard's Tale as well. I'm having a lot of fun with it. Type exclamation point OP, guys, if you want to see a link, find out more about the game. Just came out today. All right, here we go. Insert the key. It. It's this one, right? Yeah. I was gonna cry if there wasn't the right key for this. Minor spell book, a staff in gold. Oh my god, this was totally worth it. A long pole used as a weapon. Minor spell book, energy for works well with the oak wand. Four percent energy. Fire damage bonus 2%, lightning 2%, frost 2%, and poison. Ah, okay. So let's let's go to the videotape. Fog out of the mage. If we use the oak wand in our main hand. No. And then in our off hand, we put the spell book. So now we've got all those bonuses, I guess. Works well with the oak wand, right? Because that's what we have. Oak wand. All right. We'll try it. Of course, I just messed everything up. Oak wand and the book. And then Yoska. He gets nothing. You get nothing. Good day, sir. Oh, I have the staff. A long pole uses the weapon. Do we want to do that? It's like a two-hander, right? One to six. Now that'll bring everything down. These screens are confusing with the mouse issue. I know. What could cause that? Somebody could do Google food for me. They, uh, mouse pointer on OBS. Not the same as in game. Something like that. Let's see if you can see if there's any quick solution to that. All right, how many secrets have we found? We found, ooh, we found five of eight secrets now. We still don't know what to do with that statue with no head. That's gotta be one of the secrets. And there's two other secrets we haven't explored at all. Force scaling in OBS? On the game capture? Let's see. Properties. Uh, force scaling. That took the uh, the game capture away. That, that took it away. Force capture. That 
doesn't work. That doesn't work. When I when I enable force scaling, it uh it takes everything away. Um what's re what's the resolution for um never mind, I got it. Hold on. 2048 2048 by 1152 Does that work? No. Nope, force scaling is not working. I found an old post that says under settings, check disable display scaling on high DPI settings. Uh... What about capture cursor? You guys can't see my cursor now, right? Is that better if you can't see my cursor? I wonder, is that better or worse? Not better. Probably not better. All right. Sorry, gang. I don't know why that worked. This is the second game that uh, I've had where this issue occurs. Yeah. Very strange. Very strange. Oh, wait, that might work. Hold on. Is it working? No. The force scaling is working now. But it's not fixing the issue. What is... Nine hundred and sixty by five forty. Could that be it? No, I can't figure it out. Oh well, gang, we'll just have to deal with it. We'll just deal with it. Sounds like usually an issue with OBS and the game using different resolutions. Yeah. All right, so let's just see. Can we find map is 97% complete. And there's three more secrets. All right, let's go back to down this way. We haven't saved it in a while, have we? Save game. Okay, just on the other side of this barricade is the start. We can go up and down over here. I think this is all... We, we've done this a thousand times, so we're not going to go there. Let's try going down up here. Remember, some of these walls can just be false, too. Which makes it really tough. Unless you're bumping into every wall. bump over there. Ooh! Wait, have we seen- have we found that before? Oh, okay, we found that before. Oh, I got all excited. I got all excited. We had found those before. 
Okay, we know we've searched all of that. Beautiful. A resplendent offering. What? What just happened, Alaska? Hold on, hold the phone. Sometimes Patreon is weird. Sometimes Patreon is weird. Do -do -do -do. Alaska. Alaska just pledged an additional $5 on Patreon. There we go. Let's add some more time to the stream. Thank you so much, Alaska. Yeah. Oh, it's good. It's good. All right. Thank you, Alaska. Alaska has, is our longest standing Patreon supporter. It's something like 60 months or something like that. It's crazy. Okay, um... This is where the dragon was. Can't interact, can't jump in this pool. We definitely can interact with this. We don't have an item to place on it. So this is, this is really what we want to find. We want to find a head for that statue or some item for that. But pretty soon, I'm just going to say, screw it. Let's move on. We don't have to find every secret. You know? Can't hug every cat, either. So. Can't hug every cat. Do do loot. We've got this room again. Some cats don't like to be hugged. True. That's why you can't hug them all. You hugged your cat for me? Aww. Tolfot, is you replaying Vampire the Masquerade Bloodline since they announced too recently? I love the game, but damn, the graphics are wonky at times. Yeah, I, I'm interested in the in the the second game. I've never played the first game. It's funny though. I can't I can't believe how long it's been since since that game came out, right? Because I have a memory of so so long ago, like 1998, going over to my boss's house. He lived right around the corner from me. I worked for. It's really nice guy. He was into gaming too, and uh, I remember going over his house, and he was playing it and showing that that game to me, like 1998, something like that. All right, I have I have no idea where else to go. What we haven't searched. It's the Muppet Show with our very special 17 month resub. Yay! Cat hugs. Car Buckety! Thank you so much for that resub and adding time to the stream. Hype and love in the chat for Car Buckety and the resub. Yeah, everybody, check your resubs, check your Twitch primes. And uh, if you resub, it's going to add five uh, minutes to the stream. We're doing a Bogathon today. You can type exclamation point Bogathon. There you go, Rojo Brandon. Bogathon. And in 10 minutes to the stream. Thank you so much, Rojo Brandon. See, there we go. We can keep this party going, gang. Remember, if we hit uh, max time today, and then we hit max time tomorrow, we've got giveaways like Sekiro, Shadows Die Twice. Here we go. Let's see. If we can get this timer back up over... Let's say if we get this timer back up over two hours, I'm going to give away a copy of Operencia. How's that? Let's do that. Can we hit that?
Okay. I have a question for you guys. Look at this. What is this? Oh, this is the light well with the rune slots. Oh, never mind. Okay. Do you think if we go here and fall in this hole, it does something good? Bloodlines was released in 2004. All right, let me think. Well, I was still working for him in 2004. So it's 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 probably 2000 and uh, 1998 is when I first started working there. So Anyway, it, it was a long time ago. You're killing me with the pointing and asking. I can't help it, Marauder. You gotta just, you gotta ignore it. I, I can't, like, look on... I can't do this every time. <laughs> There's nothing I can do about that. <laughs> All right. You should try to find the time. Maybe Tolfantos when, when the next game is closer to being released. All right, so maybe we can fall in this hole here and go someplace new. We can try that at least. The other thing is I've got Lake of, uh, of Anna Basement 2. There's no map here. As if we haven't been there. And I don't see any way to go down. This is going up. Wait, this is going up. This is going up. This is going up. Up also up everything goes up there's no down all right the only the only clue i have to go on is literally going to a tower. Let's try it. In 2000, there was Vampire the Masquerade. Probably. That might have been it. I don't know exactly what game it was because I never played it. So we want to go down over this way. And we're going to go down in the basement. Blub, blub, blub. No. Nothing down here. The skeleton doesn't have anything. Okay. Falling down one of these holes is the answer. You know it is. Here we go. No, that's not it. That's not it. <laughs> that's not it. That's right, not the secret. All right, we're leaving. We're gonna leave. Yeah, I think I tested that hole before, too. Once I fell and broke my knee again, it fell all familiar. I was like, oh, yeah, I remember breaking my leg here before. All right, let's rest. Yes. Save. Yes. And let's go. Hey, Brew Brew, what's going on? Hey, Auto Jeb. How's it going? If anybody's new to the stream having fun today would appreciate if you guys hit that follow button it's free to follow it's that a little heart-shaped button on the top right hand corner of your player we'd love to see you again 
If anybody has any questions about the stream, what are we doing today? Let me know. Ask our community. We're playing a brand new game called Operencia today. It is a dungeon crawling, turn-based combat, puzzle solving adventure game. And I have a lot of fun with it. Of course, not getting 100% completion on the first dungeon is driving me crazy, but I can't. Let's go do something more exciting, though. So, we're gonna exit. Here we go. Is this game free? No, it's not free. But I do have a copy of the game. Auto Jeff, thanks for following. I do have a copy of the game I'm willing to give away to one lucky watcher if we can get our timer over two hours. Okay, right now we have 22 minutes left in the stream. You can see that on the top left-hand corner. If the timer goes up over two hours, we'll do the giveaway. All right, here we go. Let's go. Innocence. Whoever designed these rune keys was absolutely not thinking of me at the time. I thought I was gonna rot in that cage. Thank you. Can we follow you out? Yes, of course. Wow. We did it, didn't we, Yoshka? Indeed. How does it feel to be a bona fide hero? It's not heroics, it's just what I was meant to do. Oh, then you won't mind if I take all the reward then, will you? Hey! Alright. First dungeon complete. The duo exited the castle in triumph. But it was not long before a young knight crossed their path. Out of breath, Mezei greeted the companions with delight, but not without a great sense of urgency. Word has already spread of your deeds, the young mage and the bandit. I come before you great heroes with a desperate plea. There's only one hero for you to thank this fine evening, and it's not me. Evening? Alas, sunrise was four hours ago. If you can call it that. Impossible. While you face the evil forces below, a new darkness fell upon the land. Really? A literal darkness. It seems the sun has vanished. Like he said, impossible. Unless there's a healthy sum of gold involved in whatever you ask of us, of course. Then I'm up for hearing you out. There is. Just one question. You with me, hero? No. You are with me. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. What exactly would you have us do, Meze? Find the sun. I'm sorry. What? Find the sun? <laughs> the king has apparently misplaced it. You have the full support of the royal army, which, after so many failed attempts at freeing the prisoners, is now me. Well, how reassuring. But I must ask, how do we find the sun? I don't know, but I do know of someone who might. We must head to the great forest. Okay, so this game is called Operencia the Stolen Sun. I guess it's literal, yeah, exactly. In daylight, the great forest invites all with lush scenery and friendly animals. One second backward, okay? But when darkness falls, that is when thrive the creatures of the night. And with no sun to stop them, they've never been more active. They've never been hungrier. Oh. ooh and maybe we'll fight stuff now that can be poisoned. All right, take a deep breath and enjoy the woodland scent of the great forest. There's nothing else quite like it throughout all of Aparencia. It's too bad. It's also the only thing not out to kill you. All right. Um, Backwood, thank you so much for the 36 months. Look, down in the swamp. It's a fish. It's a boat. It's Super Otter. <laughs> Just like that. Just like that. Yes, Backwood. Now you have the superhero otter next to your name. Hype and love in the chat for Backwood's resub. Sorry, I muted the alerts during the cutscene there. Thank you so much. And that's going to add more time to the stream. All right, here's the forest. Oh, that's beautiful looking.
Oh no, gushy spiders. As they enter the forest, Woo we got ourselves a new honor. Welcome to the swamp. The merchant of the woods. All right. Hm. A traveling Taltush once told me he has the best weapons in the land and the most knowledge. A Taltush? You really don't leave your home much, do you? Taltush are slaves to the old Taltush. Thing. The only thing crazier than their outlandish attire is their belief they have magical powers. Meze. We have come a very long way, and the path ahead of us is extremely dangerous. Are you sure about this? It's the best lead we have. That's good enough for me. Let's go. You hear those bugs all around us? I'll bet they're almost as big as we are. Let's hope you're wrong. All right. We got a third member of our party. Find the house of the Merchant of the Woods. All right. Tolfantos, thank you so much for gifting us up to Auto Jeb. That is awesome. We're going to add more time to the stream because of that. And uh, Auto Jab, congrats. You get all of the perks for the next month, courtesy of Tolfantos, including all the auto remotes. No commercials while you watch the stream. You can post links in chat. Access to special sections on Discord just for subscribers. Triple clams while watching the show that you can spend on giveaways and sound effects. All that and more. This place looks awesome. This is cool as hell. All right, and what about our guy? Meze? I wonder if the Yuska and Meze... I wonder if they shuffle who you get comp depending on what character you choose in the beginning. Wouldn't you think? Right, if we chose... like a hunter right away, would Yuska be something different? I don't know. Sar, well, if the sun is missing, why do we see a crescent moon? There's a big piece of space debris, roughly spherical in shape, blocking out some of the light from the moon. Why is the moon showing at all if the sun's gone? I don't know. It's a good point, though. That is a good point. All right, so Meze, he needs a helmet. Hey, look, we have a helmet. He needs a necklace. No, we don't have that. You, We have gloves for you, though. Uh, ranged weapon? Yeah, you can have a sling. Oh, he's got boots. What kind of boots you got? Oh, he's got nice boots. You have nice boots. Longsword does 1 to 10 damage. Where's your stats? What about our spear? Spear is better. Boop. It's two-handed, though. All right, we'll give him the spear. Is there a cat to go with those boots? It is boots with boots. This is absolutely gorgeous. There's, oh! there's no puss. With boots, no, but there is, boots? is there is dog with clog. You're a dog with clog? Yes. Dog with clogs. Yes. Hello, dog with clogs. Hello. Dogs with clogs. How cool does this place look? Don't you just want to live here? Babe, hey, this is your kind of thing. It's very pretty. Isn't this you? Yeah, that's very pretty, actually. It's gorgeous. Oh, I love it. We're gonna get our butt kicked by stuff in here. Oh, I like that. Whoop. Hey, is there another way to go here? <laughs> Auto Jeb now picturing a dog in clocks. <laughs> now picturing a dog in clocks. Yes. Duck with luck. I feel like things are scurrying all around us. And I hear a fairy bell. 
Oh, there's a spider. I'm gonna surprise it. Surprise the spider. Ambush. Giraffe in a raft. All right. Poison resist. This guy, though, with all of his poison spells. They literally are trolling us. Fire sensitive, huh? All right, here we go. Combustion. Poison plus fire. Boom. These things have a lot of health. Nine to 27 damage to one enemy. Lightning has a 100% chance to transfer the next enemy unit. This chance reduces by half each thereafter. Okay, and this Wiggler's got what? Stay sharp, encourage your party members, granting them agility, intelligence, and initiative bonuses. Turtle, turtle! Get into a turtle formation to increase the party member's defense and making them untargetable for 25% chance for two turns. Taunt? Not today? Oh, he has no offense. He's like a buffer. There you go, kill that one. What? Not fair. What did he just do? He just insta-killed his friend? What did he do? Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, he ate his friend and became a monster. Look at him. He's got 123 health. He has a nice blue jog suit on. <laughs> it's his track outfit. Yeah. <laughs> what? Yeah. GHZ. How do you say your name? Geese? Geese? Geese365. Half the team is watching the stream. Great stream. Thank you so much. Thanks for being here. Congratulations on the launch. That's a pretty cool mechanic, actually. Yeah, he became a giant spider. Gigahertz? Gigahertz. Okay, there you go. Gigahertz. We'll call you Gigahertz. 1.21 gigawatts. All right, fire sensitive. Oh, yeah? Turtle. Taunt. Woohoo! We got ourselves a new honor. Welcome to the swamp. Aw, oh, Carb Buckety, thank you so much for gifting a sub to Gigahertz. Appreciate that. You are awesome. Thank you. You know what? We'll do this too. We'll do, we'll do both. GHZ three six five. Make you a VIP. And then uh, what was uh, what was Cracker's full name? VIP it was Cracker what? Cracker Viso. We have the name somewhere. Cracker. Cracker Viso, right? Cracker Viso. Whoop! There we go. It's not gigahertz? Let's see, look at that. So how, what do we call you? Geez? Geez? Can I show you take a break soon? Yeah, I have to take a break. You're yeah, right. You I do. I haven't taken a break because the game's too much fun. I know. I know. I haven't even finished my lunch yet. It's too good. All right, let's give... Uh, Stay sharp, everybody. I gotta kill this other spider before it eats it and becomes even stronger, yeah? Let's do that. Call you G? G. Alright, there you go. G. She's good. All right. This this spider got I'm glad he keeps missing. I could put the I could use the fire spell, but I guess I should. I don't want to use too much energy. I don't know when we're going to be able to save it again. A 
Let's use herbalism on Bog Otter here. There we go. That so soon. Spider gets so tough when he eats his friend. Oh, new another helmet. Some of the tallest headgear one will ever wear. It gives you intelligence plus two. Can we go back to the killer frogmen again? Yeah, right? Right? Giant spiders. They seem to have acquired some sort of cannibalistic power that enables strong spiders to grow larger by consuming the weak. Just when you think you're close to victory, thwip, their own spider bite marks makes them even more powerful. It may be the most disgusting thing I've ever seen in my life. It's because you haven't seen me eat breakfast. A gleaming endowment. Vulcan HP. Thank you so much for the $10 tip. We're going to end 10 minutes of the stream. Thank you so much for your generosity, man. I appreciate it. Yeah. He eats his friend, Naka. He does. It's funny. I got your remote since you're called Otter Jeb in some places. Oh, yeah? My party looks like it consists of Skrillex, Tony Stark, and Channing Tatum. Oh, okay. That's what I was thinking, too. Oh, there's a, like a stag beetle over there. All right. What did I want to do? I wanted to equip this helm. Get rid of the leather hat. This gives me more intelligence. Boop. All right, he's got the leather onion hat. This will be worse, and this will be slightly better. This place is spooky. Uh -oh. Well, that cave sure looks inviting. It's not. Ready your weapons. Well, I didn't actually mean that. <laughs> you heard the man, Yoshka. <laughs> He's gonna take everything literally. The eggs, they pulse. No. Let's see what's in this cave and never return. Deal. Let's get behind it and ambush it. There we go, ambush. All right, two giant spiders. Ugh. Trying to trying to be conservative with our spells here, but don't eat each other. Good. Yes, hit us. Oh, could you stop missing? There we go. Okay. Now they're not as scary. Ah, oh, I should have attacked. With melee. Should have done melee. Come on! Stop missing! Oh. There we go. There's no spell powerful enough to clean up this mess. Just gold. What does the wand do to your basic attacks? I don't know how the wand works. I don't know. Maybe the folks at uh, Zen can tell us. How, how does the wand work with like attacks, like melee attacks and stuff like that? It does two to four melee damage, I guess. I don't know how it works. Is it under skills? I don't think so. Nope. Sense of humor it, it is really awesome in this game. They're not getting any smaller, are they? This Meze, is the Spider Queen. You should wedge your neck between its pincers while we flank it from each side. There are viable tactics that do not involve my probable demise. Let's just kill this thing. <laughs> that guy is utterly humorless. I love it. Utterly humorless. It's a bad 
fight to get into having not rested, you know? Oh, he just webbed us. Oh, God. This is bad. That's a good heal for us. Okay. Taunt them? Yeah, maybe. Let's do the turtle formation. He doesn't have any energy to heal or do anything. This sucks. 96% chance. Let's do that. Very badly wounded. See, there's only a 57% chance on that. 57% chance on melee, 71 on ranged. Missed anyway. Uh, we're low on life. There we go, we got it. All right, what do we get? A nice pouch. Spider eggs, gold, and a hood and tunic. A tunic with a hood, often worn by shadier folk. Literally is shadier. Is everyone all right? So long as that huge throbbing thorax you're holding allows us to head farther north, I'm fine. Your tactics were sound. Still like my head in the pincers idea. Okay. What did we just get? We got like this hooded tunic. Gives you frost resistance, initiative, but everything else kind of goes down. Yoska? It's probably best for him. Initiative is two, frost resist. All right, let's put it on him. We also got spider eggs. It feels like something is moving inside. Ew, nice pouch. I still don't know what to do with pouches. Maybe, maybe you do sell them at a vendor. I don't know. Can we not burn them? Firewood. Okay. At least the cave. was not super huge.